everyone welcome back to the channel this is brian today we're going to be continuing our playthrough of men of madon the theatrical cut and if you haven't already that would be a great time to go ahead and hit subscribe it'll help the channel out a lot and we are so close so close to hitting our goal of 100 subscribers by the end of the year so if you haven't already it'd go a long way to help us and help the channel and uh, it'd mean a lot to me personally so all that out of the way, we're going to go ahead and jump into the game, and I'll see you as soon as we get back out on the ocean. So we're back on the ship. It's the only way we can explain all this evil shit that's happening down there. Let's just stay calm and relatively sane about this. No one's even talking about Conrad. Wait, where's Conrad? Oh, there she goes. Has anyone seen him? We got split up. I, I saw him. I, I mean, Fliss and I both did, uh, right? <clears throat> Yeah, but just for a second, I tried to catch up, but he was gone. Gone where? Why? This this just doesn't add up. I feel like you're not telling us everything, Fliss. Look, I don't know what you want me to tell you. I didn't see anything. Is that the truth? Because you better hope it is. Okay. Let we're me make him threats. Right now, we're gonna find my brother. Julia. He could be dying right now. We have to. We will. Uh, he already died. Just not yet. Well, what the fuck is going on with this ship? Because I gotta be honest, it feels like there's some like, like evil, like literal evil going on down there. Let's just stay calm and relatively sane about this, okay? The stuff I saw, it's like there were these old soldiers, they were bodies, they were dead, but then they came alive and- That doesn't sound that crazy right about now. Alex wasn't the only Alex. What are you talking about? There were things walking around with his face on them. Alex's face, it, it was horrifying. Julia, I'd never hurt you. You know that, right? No, I know, it's just... This can't all be happening. Well, it is. <laughs> like, one thing could, but not all of these crazy things. It's too much of a coincidence. There's gotta be something going on here. What can we absolutely be sure about? What do we know that's real? Am I crazy or are we on a ghost ship? I was gonna say the same thing. Well, I know we're no, not I don't the think first so. people to see weird shit here. Apparently the guards were super freaked out by something they saw in the cargo holes. We found a note that said a bunch of guys tried to get out of guard duty because they were really freaked out by something. What do you think actually happened to this place? Beat me, man. Did you see the gold? Anything? Manchurian gold isn't actually gold. It's a fucking chemical and it's leaking all over cargo hold too. Yeah. Yeah, that's really right. Sure this isn't exactly what she our found that. fishermen are expecting neither. This should go over well. What happened to everybody on this ship? Where did they all go? I can't shake the feeling we're in one They died. Coffin. So where did all the corpses come from? They actually look like they've been scared to death. We know more than we did before. That's something, at least. We're wasting time. Whatever we do, we have to do it now. Time to get off this ship. We're not going anywhere without the distributor cap. The Duke needs it to run. Hold on. This ship's gotta have a radio. If we can find it and use it... That's great, but... That's a good plan. It still works? Just need to find a way up there. At least she can see. We gotta get off this damn ship. <laughs> no shit. I think we're, uh, speaking clinically, totally effed. Oh, come on, Brad. I mean, what's that supposed to do? guns that took down the plane from our dive. This is who they were coming to rescue, wasn't it? Another clue or something? Swiss cheese. 
I don't know how far you'd actually get on that. I'm super excited about a possibility of a supermassive game on Stadia. An exclusive, that is. Hey, a little help over here. I think this is our way up. Give me a lift. Really, Brad could have done that. I'll pull you up. That was kind of strange the way it faded to black. Come on, Brad, get up the stairs. Did they go this way? Nope. Maybe they'll find his body. At least then they'll know that he died. Over here. Got a way through here. Yeah. Just just enough. Just enough to get it done. There's another body. A painting. Every time I've ever done a playthrough of this, Conrad lived, so this is all new for me from here on out. Francisco, you'd be crazy to take this route. It's almost like they didn't want anyone to know they were coming. Like hide and seek out in the ocean? I thought I saw something right there. I guess I didn't. Maybe it was just a reflection of the flashlight. Or something. Okay, so I guess we get through this door. Yeah, that's gross. Looks like this poor sucker fit it right in the middle of his message. Hmm, sounds pretty desperate. I die.
Take a look. Oh, we found the radio. No freaking way. This thing actually still works? Well, radio science hasn't changed much in 70 years. As long as there's power. I'll give it a whirl. Ah, it's working. It's a number station. Military bandit. Let's ask them for help. Hey, hey, is anyone out there hearing this? Hello? Calling for help. Shit. We got him. Uh. If you can hear us, we're on a ship, an old freighter. Our coordinates are approximately uh, 12 degrees 30 minutes south, 151 degrees 20 minutes west. Please get here now. We need help. Huge and old. Hello? Hello? Is anyone out there? Please come in. Mm. Was it really even working? Hey, come here, look. I hope they find Conrad's body. Somewhere. Maybe we can find a way to get the power back. We need to get that radio working. I think someone should wait here in case a message comes through. I'll go, obviously. I can do this. I should be the one to go. Hey, little bro. What's up? I'm thinking you might deserve a promotion. How's medium bro sound? <laughs> medium bro. What are, you, what are you talking about? You stepped up to the plate. Put yourself right in the line of fire. You're kind of mixing metaphors there. Not if the picture's a machine gun. <laughs> I'm impressed. Seriously. So what do you think? I got... I got this. I'm not losing you to this fucking ship. I'm coming too. Hey, what? Julia, no. Uh, you're not always gonna be there to protect big guy. I can handle this. Trust me. Whoa, whoa. If Julia says she can handle it, she can handle it. Case closed. All right. You and me, Julia. <laughs> she can handle it, all right. <laughs> They just fall through like multiple levels. Any broken bones? Everything still work? You guys all right down there? I'm okay. You see anything? We're gonna have to find the generator. If we can get it started, we can power up the radio. Uh, okay. We'll wait here by the radio. Here. Hey. I've never seen a lantern like that. After you. Joe was in the sick bay. 
That must have been like a log. So it looks like there was some sort of fight and this Charlie went to the brig. Yeah, that's just kind of talking about what we saw right at the beginning. Medical officer's report. So I can see if there's anything on the note. See if there's anything on the other side of that paper. So pretty much everything we've seen isn't real. It's caused by the exposure to the Manchurian gold. I'm gonna need a hundred hot baths if we ever get out of here. We're gonna get out of here, Julia. I hope you're right. Am I ever wrong? No, uh, sometimes I'm sure. There's that guy's kid. Might have been the son of someone on board. Yep. Wow. Jesus. So, or is this the actual sick bay right now? See what Julia is in here doing. Come take a look. Look down there. I think that's the engine room. Good place to find the generator, right? Let's find out. Shit. More ladder. I can drop the rest of the way. Wait. <clears throat> Are you okay? Yeah. Fine. Come on down. <sighs> what was that? You didn't fucking see that? Oh, okay. See, look at the look at the around their feet. Manchurian gold. Hello? Yeah, I think I'm actually seeing clearly for the first time in a while. Nothing jumped out at me. So, the ship was carrying Manchurian gold. But that was really some sort of hallucinogenic bioweapon developed in China during World War II. We know it was unstable and leaked all over the ship. Maybe it's still here, and it's having the same effect on us. Paranoia, hallucinations. That was what this stuff was designed to do. The crew was hallucinating. Exactly. I know they were scared of something, and the officers thought it was just a bunch of jumpy GIs trying to get out of guard duty. All this crazy shit going on, none of it's real. None of it's actually there. This couldn't have anything to do with the plane wreck we dived. It was a search and rescue plane. The whole reason it even came out here was because the people on the ship sent out a distress signal. I guess by the time the plane got here, it was too late. Everyone on the ship had lost their minds, so they shot it down. Who knows what the hell they were thinking, or what they thought they saw. Oh, God. All right, let's get going. Let's see if we can get the, let's see if we can get the radio working. 
What's this? this the rebreather i bet the fisherman brought it from the duke you think it still works uh it's got maybe a few minutes of air left worth taking with us it's just gonna slow us down no we should take it parts of the ship are completely underwater We found him. Oh, I thought he was dead. Oh, he just killed his he just killed his buddy. There's what we need right there. I thought I was going to miss one that time. The spirits of the dead are coming for me. <laughs> Did we leave the distributor cap? More hiding, I think. Oh, he is a What's the problem with sharing our food? It's not gold. Go. 
If we ran, where would we run to? My big old hammer, I want to smash! I'll let it open a little bit and hit him. Is this gonna hold? Or do we need to start running again? We're good. I think. to life that shouldn't be alive it's inside now inside with us now please just calm down stop stop it's in one of us isn't it put the gun down now why would you say that why are you telling me what to do yeah you breathed in the mist it's happening i can feel it this guy is gone. Okay. Look, there was something in the last room. A, a, a fog or a mist, maybe? I knew it. I told you. Did you breathe it in? No. No, I, I mean, we held our breath, man. The, the mist is not inside of us. <laughs> I know you're all fancy diamonds, but you expect me to buy that? We've been down here for hours. You've been holding your breath this whole time. You're holding your breath right now. Oh, good. It's in me. I got the mist in me, don't I? It's in me, isn't it? Yes, yes. It's in you. Shoot yourself and let it out. Inside. No, man. There's, there's no mist inside you. I can tell. Stop. Stop lying. You can all see it in me, can't you? No. You're all just lying. The mist is inside. Oh, my God. 
You shoot in the mist? Hey, at least you didn't kill one of us. And we got rid of another baddie. Now pick up the gun. So we can shoot Captain One Eyeball. Polythemus. Where's Mr. Sledgehammer running? Great. That's just fucking great. Yeah, sure. Let's just start drowning ourselves in puddles now. Why not? Back bread and bliss. Just riveting. Hey, what's happening? Is everyone okay? He just heard the gunfire. God, please be okay, please be okay. I gotta go after him. Well, we gotta go down there and make sure everything's okay. Shit. Well, what's our play? I'll find them. Make sure they're okay. You stay here with the radio. There has to be a better idea. I'm gonna stay as far away from trouble as I can. And I'll be back as soon as I find the generator. It'll... it'll be fine. Just keep your head down. Okay? Oh, that. I wouldn't be able to handle walking around there barefoot. There was Conrad. Another painting. <laughs> That's for a little hope. Okay. I couldn't tell who that was. Swear to God, if I make it through this, I'll never even set foot on a paddle boat again.
we have here? To all field officers. I don't think we've been here as Brad, but I know we were here as Fliss. Is that Olson? Is that his name? You know, the one eyed pirate? Slinging the hammer at me. Whoa, relax. Nobody's coming after you. What's behind door number one? Easy, easy. We can figure something out. Hey, I really don't think that's the best idea. Also, open the bolt code door, flooding the cargo hold. He's just full of good ideas. Is that Julia? Two. Where's Alex? Julia and Alex were together. Where's Manchurian Gold? Where's Alex? Saw the curator again. Alex. Um. 
good job there, Julia. Not disturbing our cat. Where was Alex during that all that all that? They both lost a brother. All right, let's try it. So three of our characters made it out and two didn't. We'll see how it works out again because we're going to do another playthrough. things seemed there were always at least a couple other realities where things were probably even worse well you're right little bro fucking right conrad was running from something he was really scared like terrified terrified i i, I don't know why I couldn't see what he was seeing at. Well, uh, that's the end of the the theatrical cut playthrough. Now, there, I mean, this is the first time that I lost uh, Conrad. So there's all kind of possibilities. That's it. Game over. You're done. For now, at least. You could always try again. See if you can't do better next time around. Not a bad effort. Some lived, some died. All your fault. I suppose when the curtain falls, you're either ready for it or you're not. It's all about decisions, isn't it? Decisions made in a hurry, in a panic, made with the heart instead of the head, or vice versa. Sometimes those decisions take a long time to have repercussions. But there are repercussions. There are always repercussions. Till we meet again, maybe in Little Hope, 
maybe somewhere else. But be certain, we will meet again. It's inevitable. Thank you for hanging out with me through this playthrough, and uh, thank you for your time. Let's see what they see here. I believe this is the first time I've seen this. So out of nowhere, this thing just sent out an SOS. Guess we got a real life ghost ship here. I believe I haven't seen this before. Hey, if you like this video, we have plenty more. Just click on one of the playlists or videos below and uh, enjoy some more of our great content.